Pep, do you think the gap in quality between the two sides has got closer, or just as United have improved, you are continuing to improve, so it's the same as ever? I never expected in this position the previous seasons when you finish, and right now to have Unai Glent here in England, to have this distance against United these three, four years. Sorry, could you say that? Between Liverpool and ourselves? No, between yourselves and United. Do you think the gap in quality between you and United is getting closer as they improve, or do you think you are continuing to improve as well, so it's the same as it ever was? Uh, um, I think the, que- the answer was, I understood, uh, sometimes I don't understand the questions, but this I understood, so... Uh, it was just me not understanding the I think so. I think the quality of United is no doubts about how big it is. Uh, I appreciate a lot the manager. I think he represents United in the exceptional way, and I think the players, when you analyze individually and collectively, they are so good. So that's why I don't see it. I didn't expect when I landed here have this gap right now against with United, even in the past. But uh, uh, what United expect is getting closer uh, to you know to the people they are above of them. But in the same time, they are working to improve. Uh, Manchester City wants to improve too. So at the end of the season, the distance is what it is. And this don't deny the, the quality. So you have 22 points behind Liverpool because they were much better than us. Pep, um, you've been at very big clubs um, all around Europe and sometimes when you're at a big club um, the, the pressure is always for instant success you have to be a success immediately are you surprised then that Manchester United are or appear to be giving Ole Gunnar Solskjaer the time to create something at United n- knowing that the club demands success but are you surprised that they're willing to wait a year two three years before while they build something Always I believe that the managers and the clubs need uh, time to to implant or to build something with the manager of the club believe. Unfortunately, the results take some time, the decision to break that process. So I'm not there. I'm not uh, part of United. But what I feel is that people believe in, in Sos and Ole. So, and, and I think he's doing a real good job. So it's not about the tactics. Sometimes it's about, you know, how how the players follow the manager or follow what. Uh, and I think in the good moments, will he arrive for an incredible impact in terms of results and in the way. And after a little bit, drop a little bit. But in the both sides, they were stable. I think the comments were stable from the board. What I read, and I think his behave here in the press conference always quite similar the same and now the results are getting back so I think they are scoring a lot of goals they create chances they concede few especially because they have a good keepers they have a good defenders big a squad is it? so United is no doubt about that all the time every season have a good 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 teams Pep I know that all um, big clubs spend big money on, on players but Manchester United in particular love to make a like a spectacular signings, you know, Maguire, Lukaku, Pogba, they all cost more money than Manchester City's record signing. Do you think that this club here will ever spend £80 million on one player or do you stick to your philosophy of, of spreading the, the, the money? I don't know, it's part of the club. When that's happened, we don't have... Well, we are in the ranking 20... The more expensive players are ranking 23 or 24. But we have a bad image in that, that looks like just Man City spend money. So that is, of course, not true, it's just to see the numbers. But uh, maybe one day it's going to happen, maybe not. So the important is, of course, the important is to buy good players, to suit perfect in the way you want to play, and suit perfect in, in terms of character. There are good players that after a short time they are not happy here. And maybe they are so expensive and the other ones so cheap and they settle. So the important is try to 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 take as much information about the player going to take is going to sweet, reduce the uncertain like a player can be in one new club. And when that's happened, 
So Manchester City didn't do that, but maybe in the future is going to do it. So honestly, right now, I don't know because it depends on the market, the players, the players that we have, the players want to stay, the players want to leave. So many, many things can can be involved. Pep, Rashford's got a good record against you and he's always looked very dangerous. How big a plus is it for you that he won't be up against you on always, Sunday? Always, as I said, from the first day I became a manager, I like to play with a full squad for my opponents. I would love to play against Hazard, against Madrid, being a people. I don't like to see Rashford out like Harry Kane when we play against, against Tottenham. I prefer to play against... Uh, top players and all the players available. So I think it's not good for United. He's absent for national team, for England national team. Hopefully he can recover as quick as possible. I would have preferred he plays that. It, uh, you obviously preferred if he played. Does it make your life a little bit easier no. that he's not there? At the moment I start to think about United. I see which players are available to play against us. And after that, yeah. I'm not concerned anymore, so I don't think for not even half a second about it's not there. So it's Martial, it's James, it's Bruno Fernandez, it's Gallo if he plays, and the way you're going to play, he play in three or four different times, different systems. The way we play, they try to settle, understand what we have to do, it depends on the quality they have, the way they play, and try to, to go there and do a good performance. Then, okay. Thank you.